Hey, what's up everyone? This is going to be another quick video. I'm trying to make several videos and take some time to make several videos about various topics. So first, there has been a magnitude 6.6 .6 earthquake that struck near Tanaga Volcano in Alaska. So this could mean there's an imminent volcanic eruption for, for Alaska. I don't know, but it struck near the volcano. So you can just keep Keep a lookout for that and maybe possible tsunamis. It might not happen, um, but you just keep a lookout and be aware and keep your eyes open and ears listening if you live in the area of Alaska because this did just happen four hours ago. It could trigger tsunamis and it could be a sign of volcanic eruptions, so we'll, we'll just have to keep watching that. The USGS has been warning of the poisonous gas emissions in the national parks. Yellowstone toxic gas gases can kill animals and uh, it could actually kill humans as well so that's a picture from many many years ago and then on the right there's the toxic gases so this is after a series of earthquakes has have been striking in Alaska an area that does not usually receive earthquakes would be the um, the northeastern area of Alaska they stated that that area is not prone to earthquakes, but a few days ago they received over 200 tremors. And then on the east and west areas, in the east and western areas, they received one, maybe two earthquakes. But all in all, they received two major 6.0 or above earthquakes a few days ago in the northeastern area of Alaska, I believe. And uh, from what I remember, they were a 6.0 or above, and they had over 200 tremors. In an area that is not prone to earthquake activity. Now, that does not mean there's not seismic activity that can take place there because that is definitely not out of the question because it, it obviously happened there. But it's they're stating that it's not in a place that's prone to it, so that's quite unusual, which has been happening quite a bit. Earthquakes away from happening away from seismic prone areas and fault lines. So they also stated that, uh, I mean, you know that these uh, major earthquakes happened a while back in Alaska, but I'll, um, I'll get into further detail in another video very soon. I just wanted to give you the breaking news update on this. Well, it was breaking as of four hours ago of the 6.6 .6 earthquake in Alaska in this area shown right here. So be on the lookout for possible tsunamis and maybe a volcanic eruption since this is happening so close to the volcano in, in 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 Alaska so there could be a volcanic eruption in Alaska so that's not out of the question I just wanted to put that out there as one of the possible scenarios not a scare tactic but just a sort of an um, an alert situation where you can keep uh, be on the lookout for such a thing I know there's really nothing you can do about something like that but there could be a volcanic eruption in Alaska since this earthquake happened so close to the volcano. Maybe not. Hopefully not. But let's keep a lookout on that. But that's all the latest news taking place as far as the 6.6 .6 earthquake in Alaska right near the volcano, the Tanaga volcano. So peace and much love. This has been Breaking News. Bye.